Reverse Rich RN here. Today I'm going to show you how I removed this Foley catheter from my patient. Okay, to remove the Foley catheter, you want to make sure you know where you're going to be taking that liquid from. Remember, this one right here is going to be if you're trying to withdraw UA. This one over here is going to be the one where we have the 10 cc of saline that's holding up that balloon. So that's the one that we're going to attach our syringe to. Okay, done my hand hygiene, patient identifiers. I've extracted on my patient what we're gonna do. So now I'm gonna take my syringe and I'm gonna attach it to here. I'm gonna go ahead and pull that out. I've already previously checked the chart and I, I know that there's gonna be 10 cc's of liquid in here. So that's what I'm expecting to be pulling out. Okay, so now that I have that, I usually have a towel handy. You also wanna make sure that you have a chuck or something underneath the patient when you're ready to pull this out. Instruct the patient, go ahead and take some deep breaths. And then when you take that deep breath, I'm gonna pull on the count of three. One, two, three. And you wanna pull kind of fast and then grab the end. And then you take your whole catheter and then you can toss that in the trash. And that is how you remove a Foley catheter.